guys, up it's Mr. Jerry. Today we are back on Would You Rather, a game that it tends to get along with me pretty well most of the time, but sometimes I end up killing the entire population for no reason, like for cake or something. Not my fault, okay? Uh, that, that's just how that turns out. But if you do like this type of gameplay, uh, definitely check out the playlist at the end of this video, which will have more of this type of game in the uh, playlist, I guess. So anyways, let's get right into this. Today, we're going to find out, would you rather be visited by aliens or be visited by mole people? Okay, so basically, would you rather be visited by people from dimension, uh, from who knows where? Really, who knows where? We don't even know if they're from, it could be from like, uh, oh, it's ancient aliens. Okay, so I guess they would be like really old aliens. They'd be really intelligent. Or be visited by mole people, which... I'm guessing it's just moles that are intelligent, but they're really big, and they dig around a lot. Okay, so the difference between the two is ancient aliens would come from a whole nother um, planet. Because they are aliens, but they'd be ancient, so they'd be really intelligent. Whereas mole people, they'd probably want to dig a lot of holes, they'd probably want to upgrade everything, and they are in, in uh, the Earth. So, therefore... I'm going to go with be visited by ancient aliens because it sounds cooler and it seems like and either, either one could be hostile, but uh, yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to say that both ways you could be hostile. So I'm going to go with this one. Oh, okay. So 80% actually agree with me and for good reason too. All right. So next. Would you rather lead a boring life from here forward? Ugh, that's a lava. Or uh, reborn with all your memories into a baby of the opposite sex? So either be boring the rest of your life, or be reborn, you get your whole life back, a whole brand new life, except the only downside is you have the opposite sex. I don't think that would be that big of a deal. Whereas, lead a boring life from here forward seems pretty awful. I honestly want nothing to do with leading a boring life. I like to be extremely energetic and head and dive into new things. So, definitely this one. Oh, and everyone agrees with me on that one. Okay, so, if you were a Winchester brother, now this is from Supernatural, would you rather be Sam or be Dean? Now, okay. I've watched the, the, the Supernatural series. Actually, I'm quite up to date with it. Sam is kind of the more smart one. Um, he's the guy that all the girls now like for his long hair. Um, he's tall, strong, good looking. Um, and he's typically smart. Dean is more of a fighter. He's also really good looking. Towards the beginning, I think towards, the, towards later on, the girls really liked him. I'm just saying based on how many girls like them. Dean was definitely the most, the more liked in the beginning, and then it kind of leaned towards Sam. Sam also has that whole demon blood thing going on. So, for that reason, just because Dean has, like, the Dean is very uh, connected with all the angels, whereas Sam's very connected with all the demons. And to be fair, I think I'd rather be connected with the angels, and he's... he's I don't know. I just I just like his personality a lot. I'm not going to get too in-depth on that, but I would rather be Dean. And I was pretty sure more people would want to be Sam. For that exact reason. Alright. Would you rather not be able to talk or not be able to walk? Okay, so it is you can't speak to people or you can't move. Um, mobility, though, you could get a wheelchair. And as far as talking, you could learn sign language or you could write everything. It doesn't mean you can't hear. You can hear. It doesn't say anything about not hearing. So, I'm going to say, see, walking, and that's the other thing also I would have to say is, what do you mean can't walk? Does that mean we can't just walk back and forth? You could hop if you had like one leg, if that's what they're talking about, walk or jump. So, because I like to talk a lot, because I'm behind a computer a lot, um, I wouldn't mind being in a wheelchair, absolutely. Um, I mean, it'd probably be better than not being able to talk. Like, let's just say you can never talk again. I would probably rather not be able to walk. For, for a couple reasons, but... 
Yeah, I think so, because anything else I could do with my hands, um, and I should be able to move around, so I'd rather not be able to walk. Oh, okay, people would rather not talk again. Alright, would you rather always have messy, unkept hair, aka my hair right now, or always have stains in your clothes? I have both, all the time. I always spill something on me. I mean, it's not like a stain I can't get out, but I always spill something on me. And always having messy hair. I mean, I try my best to get my hair up and running, but as you can see right now, it's like not even that pretty. Like, now, now I'm all bugged up my hair. I was just, I just said screw it before I started, and now I'm thinking, oh, I probably should, uh, probably should have done something with my hair. Um, I don't know. To be honest, I don't think either one really matters that much, but I think I'd rather have messy unkept hair. Um, just for that reasoning. Uh, stains in clothes. You wouldn't really want to go to a wedding or anything in a really stained up clothing. Would you rather non-stop peeing for the rest of your life? Or non-stop crying for the rest of your life? Let me think here. Non-stop peeing. Well, okay, so... It actually doesn't feel that bad. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go into actually. I'm gonna I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna do this. Peeing is not that bad feeling. Whereas crying, you have like the the low eyes. Your eyes all have a uh, like I don't know what the right word is for it underneath your eyes. Um, but like you get bags under your eyes and stuff from crying, and you feel really um I don't know. Like you start sniffling and stuff. Your nose is always runny. I would rather non-stop peeing, and it's not like we couldn't figure something out. I mean, if I knew I was non-stop peeing the rest of my life, I could hook something up and just, like, drain into the bathroom, <laughs> which, I know that sounds weird, but let's be realistic. That wouldn't be that bad, and this doesn't feel that bad. Actually, this is more of a relief, whereas this one isn't much of a relief. So, okay, so we have people would rather non-stop cry. I, I don't I don't agree. <laughs> I don't agree. I think that uh, the other one would be easier. <laughs> would you rather be like Gandalf, thou shall not pass, <laughs> or be like Luke Skywalker? Is this even like a question? I mean, I guess Luke Skywalker's got like the whole uh, he's got like the Force and everything like that, and he's really good with the lightsaber. But Gandalf's got a freaking magical wand. He took on a demon. I, 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 this isn't even fair. Yeah, I remember Gandalf. <laughs> Would you rather only watch a show for the rest of your life? Oh, wait, if you could watch only one show for the rest of your life, would you rather watch Sherlock or watch Doctor Who? Um, neither, <laughs> neither, I, I'm gonna, I know Doctor Who has kind of like magic stuff, Sherlock is really boring, so, Sherlock is all like figure out stuff, but it's all like old English, uh, and kind of, it, it works like it's modern, but whereas Doctor Who deals with like different dimensions and stuff, so yeah, I think I'd rather watch Doctor Who. Would you rather meet the Pope or be the Pope? Be the Pope. You kidding? What? How? Be the Pope would be awesome. You have like tons of power. Would you rather spit at angry Mike Tyson? You get a fist to the face or spit at angry Bruce Lee? Fist to the face or basically any move. So I think Mike Tyson would hurt more initially, but Bruce Lee moves faster. So he might actually hit you more and damage you more. Oh. I didn't say either one of them um, would kill me. Or hurt me. And Bruce Lee is dead. Mike Tyson's not dead. So... Technically, spinning an angry dead guy isn't really that dangerous. I'm gonna go with this one. <laughs> Alright, would you rather paint Van Gogh? <laughs> Van Gogh. I don't know how to say that. Or be painted by Da Vinci? Um, Da Vinci, clearly. Although, I'd rather 
to talk to him and hang out with him and ask him how he built his uh, flying machine. But uh, it's Van Gogh. I can't, I can't, I can never say it. I know how. To, I know who it is. I just can never say it. So I'm just gonna go this one. Yeah, Da Vinci is cooler. Da Vinci is cooler. All right, let's see if we can find one for you guys here. Ah, nah, this one's easy. Would you rather only use Windows or Macintosh? Windows. It has video games. Would you rather have all fingernails and toenails removed quickly, so just yanked off, or deep paper cuts on the webbing between each finger and toe slowly? I don't know. <laughs> This one is for you guys, though, so definitely make sure to tell me down below what you guys think. This one's really kind of gruesome. Um, and for anyone who uh, does answer, I will definitely be responding to you guys if I can. So, uh, and that, that being said, I'll see you next one. Make sure to leave a double up down below if you like what you see. And as I said, there are more Would You Rathers down below. This one's kind of weird. I, I've had some good and bad ones, but this one was a little bit more weird. So, uh, don't judge. There will be a new one soon out, and I'm sure I will be absolutely worse the next one. <laughs> All right, I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.